Hello and welcome to Cooking with Ryan Scott, a comedy button video Christmas holiday spectacular where I, Brian Altano, will teach Ryan Scott, a man who's never cooked before, how to cook Christmas cookies for the whole family or some of our friends and cast members. This is Ryan Scott. Say hello. Hello. They can't hear you. And welcome. Ryan, what's your history with cooking? Uh, pretty much this. So you've I, never... made, I made some rice in a rice cooker. That's it? Uh, my wife made me stir some hamburger meat one time under very close supervision, and um, I've made waffles in a toaster. So you've toasted, from a box. you've toasted frozen waffles. Yeah. So you've never cooked before. I boiled some noodles. Stop. Now, Ryan, the most important thing in the kitchen is to a have clean hands, which I saw you do off camera. I trust you. <laughs> sort of. And all b right. to know what you're cooking with and what you're working with. Now, today I've laid out all of your ingredients and all of these colorful ornate mixing bowls and these fancy silveru spoons. What do you think they do? Uh, they're for putting stuff in. Th yes, <laughs> that's, that's you're getting warmer. What, right. what sort of stuff do we want to put in those? We're gonna put the flour and the sugar okay. and the sprinkles mm -hmm. and the egg yolks okay. and the, the eggshells. The, no, 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 no. The peelings, Stop. the, no, the no, stuffings. No, there's, no, there's no peelings, there's no stuffings, no eggshells, no Chocolate yolk. milk, yummy yams. We're not cooking with yimmy yams. <laughs> right, you, don't, you can't even buy yimmy yams in a store. Oh, wow. Where do you shop? Okay, so now most importantly, we have everything laid out in front of us. We have our expert chef, Ryan Scott. We have our ingredients. Now we're gonna start measuring things out and mixing them. This recipe, which I'm borrowing from my good friend, Alton Brown. Alton suggests that we start with something called three cups of okay. flour. Now, flour. to make things sort of difficult today, I've lined out four of our main ingredients all of which are mostly white. Kind of like the comedy button. So, uh, all of these have been measured out around the same size, but you're gonna need more from over there. But first, I'm gonna need you to identify what is what. So let's start with the flour. Ah, oh, dear. <laughs> Why are you doing this? That's the flour, this one on the end. You think that's the flour? Is that the flour? I, I mean, you're a chef. I. Let's taste it. It's not rat poisoning. I'm not gonna kill you on the show. So do you want me to scoop some Just up take with your, spoon take, here? Take your, you have a clean finger. Take the tip of your finger. Get a little pinch. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> is that flour? Pretty sure. No, that's not. No. Flour. What is that? That's flowery looking. I can't tell you what it is. But I've never, tell. I've never taken a scoop of raw flour and just been like, mmm, <laughs> nom, nom. I don't know what that is. Okay, so that's not flour. That's sugar. Okay. That's sugar. Are those both sugar? They're not both sugar, I promise That's you. totally sugar. Okay, how do you know that's sugar? Because it sparkles. <laughs> so sugar, ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching home, remember, important science facts. Sugar sp sparkles, and Ryan Scott's <laughs> never taken a whole scoop of flour in his mouth before. No. Okay, yeah. so we have salt, sugar, question mark, question mark. Right? Okay. But here's what we do know. We do know that now using deductive logic, you're very good at that, right? Do you need a spreadsheet? Maybe, that would Where help. Where do you think the flour is now? Well, clearly it's in that last one. All right, great. Look at that, we've solved the Professor Layton puzzle. We did. Now we need three cups of it. Okay. Can you get me a cup? Well, I'll, I probably should uh, leave the bowls where they are. No, we can move some bowls. I'll move some bowls around for you. Let's, that let's is one cup. Bit. It says so on the handle. If it didn't, how would you know? Um, <laughs> hmm, I don't know. Good How call. I would know. All right. Hmm. This is going to be difficult. Why? Are you hinting that I should just pick it up? No, I mean, okay. no, I, with what? Your regular? Oh, God damn it. <laughs> We're on the first step. You're there in we your go. big pouch full of flour. All right. <laughs> So no. honestly, I'm gonna say, no. I'm gonna be honest with you right now. I thought the measurement part would be the easiest part. I All right. really did. Which this one's is... the flour? Now, Ryan, you have Let's other see. measurement devices here you can help to use that to is... bring that. Think, remember that puzzle in Die Hard with a Vengeance? Where they have the two water jugs and they're trying to get it to five gallons, otherwise, Jeremy Irons yeah. blows up the whole right, city. Right, right. It's kind of like that, but with flour. You're spooning the flour into the measuring thing. It's looking good. It's, you're, Okay, this is actually smart. I like what you're doing right here. You know what you're doing? There's a name for this. Uh, measuring? Leveling. Okay. So you wanna get it to the top and make it level. See, you didn't even flat. have to teach me about that. What is this stuff on the side? That's flour. Are we counting what's in the pouch? <laughs> no. 
No, you really I... got a lot of flour yeah. in that pouch. Yeah. Great. We are now one third done with the first step. How many cookies are we making here? Like, how, how much does this make? Well, that depends on the size of the cookies, Ryan. Okay. I mean, we can make one giant cookie, right? Do you want to make I... a giant cookie and we, you can ride it home and show it to your wife like it's a car? Maybe. All right. Now, we need three fourths of a teaspoon of baking powder. Do you know what baking that powder is? That would be is? the stuff that I thought was flour. Right, that's actually what it says when you buy it in the store. It says baking powder. The stuff the you, stuff thought, you was thought was flour. You don't usually, in most recipes, you don't use a lot more than just a little bit of baking powder. So it's rare to see this much poured out, but we had to fuck with you. Okay. So we have the baking powder, right? So we need three fourths of a- Of a teaspoon. Of a teaspoon. Now, are these? That one's a teaspoon. I've given you two spoons. You have, one's a teaspoon, one's a tablespoon. All right, how do you know that? because I know that those are both things and one's bigger than the other. All right, good. So now we need three fourths of a teaspoon. Which one is the teaspoon? You just told me. Is that one? Yeah. Yeah, that, I, I was looking at you for confirmation. I oh, don't you're trying to cheat the system. Well, no, I just know this is the little spoon that I use when I eat things. The big spoon is for other things that I'd never use it for. Why don't you eat big things with the big spoon? Because a little spoon, that's what you do. <laughs> My little mouth. Okay, maybe, maybe just a little, little, little dab. There. A dab, a pinch. Yeah. Now we're gonna need to add, are you ready for this? Okay. A fourth of a teaspoon of salt. That was the salt, right? I don't know why I'm doing that. Yeah. Are you that, sure? That's the salt. That's the salt. Are you sure? Get that a little, little spin. You really wanna get all up in them guts. Yeah? Yeah, just spin it around. It's good life advice. <laughs> <laughs> we need one cup of butter. One cup of butter. Do we do we melt it? Nope. No. Okay. Hmm. Have you ever opened up one of these before? Not yeah, probably. I don't know. You don't know? There we go. Either yeah. you have or you haven't. Butter for toast. <laughs> I made that too. I know how to cook some you buttered toast. You, that's not you put it in the toaster. Show me how you would measure out this butter. One cup of butter. Is yep. that what you said? One cup. Okay. That is one cup, 240 milliliters. We've covered this. Uh-huh. How would I measure out one cup of butter? That's what I asked you. Uh, I would probably start chopping it up and throwing it in the cup until I'm like, that looks like one cup. Here's a butter knife. Oh, good. There's flour all over your hand. Well, you said that, okay. Okay. This, this is gonna go wrong, isn't it? We're heading into a situation, right? You wanna show the camera what we got here? We got we butter have, We have is a circle full of squares. Hold on, how much, how much butter was on this? Why don't we take a look? What, let's... Uh, oh, hey, look at that. There's a measurement. Hey, look. Yeah! This is a half cup of butter right here. Yep. Oh, cool. Get out of here, you butter. <laughs> That's good, so we have our butter. Yeah. Now we need our sugar. That's good. <laughs> Now, Ryan Scott is spooning out sugar, which is his favorite technique. <laughs> what, should I just pour it? I'll make a mess and you know it. Just try, just pour it, get it over with. These people got things to do. Oh, okay. <laughs> I love that part where you do, you give it like a nice, it's like a nice pat on top. Like, oh, good, good boy, sugar. Okay, so we pour the sugar on the butter. Are, are you, is this a trick? No, this is the uh, best, most, uh, Famous Def Leppard song is pour some sugar on my butter. <laughs> All, All right. right, wow, there we go. We got sugar butter. Oh, All right, can God we get a, damn it. <laughs> can we get a good look at this? I'm being all like dainty and- There we go, get in I'm there. I'm sorry. Get all, get all fucking nut, I'm not like that. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, I need to- That's gross. <laughs> what, what do you want me to all do? Right, now you mix it all up. Uh, why don't I have an electric mixer? Okay, no good. <laughs> <laughs> do you want a, Do you want an electric mixer? Can you do this for me? Should we give them an electric mixer? They just said yes. Oh dear. We have our We have our producer here handing us an electric mixer. After all the stuff is on the wooden non-electric mixer, and this is uh. All right, this Ryan, is, take all the stuff ugh, off of the spoon. Ugh. My hands. There are... is a way to do this with a spoon. I just want to point that oh. out. Okay, can I wash my hands? <laughs> Here, I need a towel. Fuck. 
It's gonna be fucking Halloween by the time we're done with these fucking and sugar we're, cookies. And we're back. Here's your electric mixer. All right. I don't even know where to start with All this right. shit. All right. How does this work? Is this yours? Did you bring this from home? Just st stop. Don't even. Did you? D don't worry about it. I can't get that in. <laughs> I can't get it in, guys. <laughs> Let me see the fuck. Seriously, seriously, I can't get, I cannot get that in. Cause you're, you're all slimy. Okay. Nope. All right. Remember Benjamin Franklin with the cut? No, don't push that button. Hmm? You made it come out again. Bum, 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 bum. All right. Remember when Benjamin Franklin got the kite? What did he have to get? Oh, it's not even plugged in. Look at that. What do I do that's not going to have this blow up? Adam? I want to tell you something real quick. Okay. I'm legit scared for my life right okay. now. Okay. There you go. Uh, uh. Up in them guts. All right, so we want to beat this until it's light in color. How's it look? Until it's light and, and color? I know you're used to beating things until they're red. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, I guess that looks good. Like your dick. I got it, Brian. Got it. All right, now we need one egg. All right. Th okay, this is the part you should be afraid of. Brian, let me ask you something. You're holding an egg. Yeah. Have you ever cooked an egg before? No. No? You've never cooked one egg? No. Have you ever cracked open an egg before? I, not, that, not that I'm confident in, uh, in reporting, no. I don't, think, I don't think I ever have, no. You've never we, we We gently crack it and then the stuff goes in. Okay. That is not, that is too gentle. Yeah. Did you take a look at it? Did you crack it yet? There's a crack. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I need to keep going. Ryan, I, I'm legitimately scared I'm going to make a mess at this point. Ryan, all you have to do is open the egg and get it in the damn bowl. You really have never cracked an egg yeah. before. Huh? No. No, clearly not. Oh. Okay. Oh, look at that. Come there's, on. There's some Come on, shells. little one. What are you going to do with that shell? I don't know. No. Oh, God. What are you, <laughs> what are you doing? I, I'm trying really hard not to get any eggshells in it. You're getting eggshells everywhere. You want a clean break. Oh, that is not a clean break. Oh. <laughs> don't worry. We have a dozen eggs, which might not be enough. Oh, dear. Okay, so you want to give that a good squeeze to get that. Oh, God. <laughs> I think I think this one is compromised. Okay, well let let's try to get it out of there. See if we can save it and see what happens. Okay, ready? No. Just give it. A, just open it. Oh, you gotta stop oh. doing that. It's really gross seeing you put your finger in there. Oh my god. All right. Well, that's just the egg white and some shell. If you were on a, a diet, then that'd be pretty good because a lot of people don't want to eat on oh, there. There's the whole thing. <laughs> is there anything else in there? Did you get the prize? <laughs> oh boy. There should be yeah. a Disney figurine. We got that one. Can I tell you a trick for getting eggshells out of eggs? Sure. Get your finger a little wet and then pull it out. It's an actual real life cheat code. It might not work with you because you're covered in butter and weird <laughs> stuff. We Done. need one tablespoon of milk. This is gonna be a fucking mess. One of these of milk. Yep. Yeah, I just spilled a little. That's good. Okay. In here? Yeah. Now to... What? Yes. Okay. I was going to make you do a trick and tell you that to get it to room temperature, you have to hold it for five minutes. Oh, I hate you. That just right. messing with you. So one, that's it? So all that's in there. Now we need you to get your electric mixer back and beat these things again. So I just pour it in slowly? Yep. How slowly? Slowly. To let, let it integrate and then mix as you go. You're going to need all of it. I know. I'm, my hand's tired now. <laughs> you have this miraculous way of making everything you touch look gross. It, I think it's because your fingers become little mangled claws. <laughs> I, well, I'm, do, I'm, like, I'm sitting here a little bit of it going like, ew, as I do it. You make cooking look like ferrets mating. No, God, you're Ugh. so nasty. <laughs> look at that. It's all over. <laughs> 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 From here, it's going to go, from here it's going to go into the fridge where it's going to cool for a few minutes. 
or okay. the freezer if we want to speed up the process a little bit. That'll make it a little easier to work with. Otherwise, it's just a big wet ball of clay. So I have a question for you. Did you have, did you have Play-Doh growing up? Yeah. Um, were you one of those kids that opened it up and left it on the stairs for it to dry out, or did you actually build things with it? I usually just let it dry out. Got it. Because it looks to me like you've never formed anything with anything before. 20 minutes. Can you open the freezer for me, please? Will you do this one thing? Thank you. All right, so this is Cooking with Ryan Scott, and somehow we're still alive. We'll see you in 20 minutes. It's time for a time lapse. So we've taken the dough out of the freezer. It's now firm and hard, like your mother's tits, and we can use it to make wonderful, what? In the meantime, I've preheated the oven to 375 degrees, so you wouldn't have to do that. I'm not at the point where I totally trust you to do that yet. What we need to do is cut this dough in half and roll it out. Whoa. Uh. Now you've got it here, right? Yeah. We've got this, what's this tool right here? That's a rolling pin. Before you do that, rolling pins tend to stick to dough that's sticky sometimes. I don't okay. know if this will be a problem particularly because it's a, you made a weird man's dough, but <laughs> I think if you go into the flour right there, okay. take some out and you lubricate your rolling pin a little bit, you might have an easier roll. I'll get a bowl. Okay. Move out of there, shapes. Then I'll, should I just get some flour and- Move out of there, shapes. It? Should I do that? Yeah. That much? Okay. It looks like I, uh, I uh, did not accomplish my goal of not making a mess. Well, no, we, we, right. we shattered that goal cool. hours ago. Okay, now we want to roll this out and make a nice big... Does it, does it need to cover the entire surface here? Is that my... No, we just no? want to make shapes, okay? <laughs> that is not going well. There we go. Lube it up good. So what we need over here is some sticks of butter. Should I wipe the flour off my hands? No, you'll be fine. Wipe it okay. on, your, on your dress. Take a little bit of butter. If Don't take the metal knife onto the metal baking sheet because otherwise oh. it'll, it'll look like Wolverine woke up drunk. Just, ooh, just. There we go, Basquiat. Massage that butter into, get in that, there, baby. into that sheet. This is the creative part of the oh process. Dear. This is where it's gonna get really fun. I want you to make cookies. I want yeah, you to make them in all the shapes. shapes you want. And I've given you a couple of shapes here. We've got the marijuana fern. <laughs> We've got the police silhouette. <laughs> We've got the Swazzle Star and the Bent Dick. <laughs> All right. Old Christmas favorites. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, that's, that's a shape. A, that's a cookie. Now, how do we save it from its tomb? <laughs> I don't know. All right. All right. We've got a star. Boom. Now cookie. we've got to transfer it onto that sheet. Get, get, uh. Ooh, it's oh, a beautiful look. little star. Look at that. The Let's shape. make another shape. Let's okay. go with the, the the marijuana cop's worst enemy, the tree fern, uh, used right. to overdose teens all over the land. Okay, put it right here. Yep. No, there's a little piece I left. It could be that's, an ornament. That's, oh, that's true. It could be like a little piece of kind bud. <laughs> it could be one of the dank furs. <laughs> one of those dank nuggets. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You know what it is? It's one of the crystals, yo. Right now, I want you to make the cast of the comedy butt. Can you do that? So five men. So let's use that. We're gonna get this dough out of here because you're just. And he's a, a look. Disaster. He's a white man too. That's Anthony. Okay. That's Max because it's all thin, probably tall. I don't know. You can also use the knife to sort of, uh, or just use your weird claw. <laughs> oh, there's Brian. Oh. Who's this? Was this Anthony? That's, that's Anthony. Yeah. Because he's a big little dough boy. Yep. Exactly. Okay. I wish you had a cat so we could make his cat. You can give him a little cat. This is All one right, of those good. rectangular standing up cats. <laughs> oh, those are his TV antennas. <laughs> his devilish horns. There's a little cat tail. There we go. What else should we make? You know what we should make? Let's make a Ninja Turtles face. Oh God. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Dun, 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 dun. It looks right. like a lowly worm's grave. We're ready to fight the Foot Clan. Sure. All right. We're using our fucked up heads <laughs> or a crashed car. Take the tray. The power glove. Okay, there. I like, why did you push it away like you're afraid of it? Cause it's hot. Okay, close it. Do you know what time it is? It is through, not 375, that's for damn sure. It is, hmm. I don't know, what time is it? <laughs> it's a good question. Uh -huh. So we have seven minutes. 
Seven right? minutes, okay. Seven or eight. Let's go, for, let's go with eight, right? Okay. Somewhere in between seven and nine. Okay. We can check in our cookies in eight minutes. Okay. So until then, let's fucking get rid of all this trash. Mm, mm, mm. It smells wonderful in here, Ryan Scott. Your cookies are ready to come out of the oven. It's been just enough time. Now let's not burn anyone or our hands or ourselves. Are you ready? This is the scary part. I don't have the heart to tell you this, but you, no one actually wears two oven mitts. Well, no one is as likely to burn themselves as me. Now okay. if I just pull that out, it's gonna, it, can I do that? All right. All right. Let's close the oven. Now we've got our, I think those are shapes. Yeah. All right, here we have Anthony's cat. This is a work of goddamn art. Look at that burnt tail you gave him. <laughs> All right, so now it's time to ice these babies. So what we have here is we have some cream, which is beautiful icing, and it's nice and warm for you. I want you to do that to apply sort of a base layer. And here we have all sorts of different colors. We've got sparkle gels, and we've got party sprinkles. Oh boy. I don't know what kind of party we you some, have with these things. We got some googly eyes. We also got googly eyes, which you can put on your friends. Oh, what a thick cream. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There we go. I like what you did there. You've applied our white skin to our naked bodies. Yeah. Okay, you wanna, let's put some. Uh, let's put some on the cat. Let's put some on the cat. Careful, you're gonna, oh. you broke his fucking tail. <laughs> <laughs> cat can live without a tail. I don't think that's true. We'll it's figure fine. it out. Oh. Here, we can always just. There, here, there we go. Watch this. A little bit of cream. Oh. Glue that tail right back on. <laughs> All right, now let's just do the uh, Ninja Turtle face oh. over here. Ryan, that cream and these cookies smell goddamn delicious. It smells like a French fucking bakery in here. Then we decorate the Christmas tree. Yep. With this fine clays. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I would suggest we put the eyeballs in the things that need them right now. All right. All right. So okay. that would be you and me, the cat, Hold and on. Ninja Turtle. I'll be the judge of this. That sounds like the name of a porno. That's a ninja turtle. Oops. <laughs> now, remember that, remember the cat's eyes. Oh, I don't think this is sticking very well. Use no. some more cream. <laughs> Ooh, this is nice. A good technique on this one. Look at that. You got going nice, around. It's like, it's thin like a fisherman's twine. Are we going with Raphael? Yeah. All right. You give him a bandana? Yeah. What about his mouth? Dun, 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 dun. That's right. I remember when Raphael smiled with a blue mouth. <laughs> 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 Raphael's finished. Now let's do uh, let's do you and I and the cat. Hmm. A little cinnamon twirl. Yeah. A little, a little bit of an infection. Okay. Now really? what about us? You got to put some clothes on us. We're naked. Which one are you? You're this one, right? Yep. Yeah. Because I'm the one with the weird eyes. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna put You're some, the one with the shitty icing vision. We're gonna put more, we're gonna put some pills on you. Why? You, you've done the most drugs. That's fucked up. Do we want doggy treats or dinosaurs? We'll go I, with dinosaurs. I like dinosaurs if okay. you wanna put dinosaurs on top of me. Oh, you, no, actually, you love dinosaurs more. That's me. I mean, I don't, I'm kind of impartial to dinosaurs, really. I think you should give yourself some glasses. Oh, yeah? I think that's gonna probably not go over very well. Why not? But give okay. yourself some nice glasses. I'll take a beard, too. Okay, here's glasses. Are you ready? Yep. Just like real glasses. <laughs> <laughs> that, wow. that, uh, that New Jersey frown, that there we scowl, go. And this, what, amid all that stubble. <laughs> what about this cat? Should we give him, what about him, an open mouth so he can call, he can cat call all of his cat girlfriends? Wow. <laughs> there we go. There we go. We have a fish there. That's a decorative Christmas tree. That is a swazzle star. We have Brian with all his, his, his drugs. Me with all my dinosaur cookies, a cat with uh, an open wound, uh, a Cthulhu spawn sporting a very fashionable elder sign, an A for April, and uh, a Ninja Turtle. Ladies and gentlemen, you just watched Cooking with Ryan Scott. I'm fucking amazed that you made cookies today. Oh. oh. Yeah. Easy there, you. If you like cooking shows like this, maybe we'll get to do more soon. <laughs> I'm not sure. We almost burned down the kitchen today, but we got frosting everywhere and made a big mess. Cooking's not for everybody, but it could be for you. It was never for him until he cracked an egg like a weird dude. <laughs>
If you like shows like this, keep watching our YouTube channel, follow us on Twitter, join our Facebook group, listen to our podcast every single week, and more importantly, go to our Patreon, kick in a few bucks, and help us make more cool shit like this. Did you have fun today, Ryan? Yeah. Are you gonna cook again? Uh, with your help, maybe. With my I think help, I need. Maybe. I think I need an adult. I can be that for you. All right. Thank you for watching, and happy holidays. There's like, there's like a salt, there's a salt, <laughs> like a ball of salt. <laughs>